tell you what, Leslie, I've had more than several bottles of water today. Man, oh man. And I got my walking in before 10 a.m. this morning. And when I finished, it was hot. All right. So we have a heat advisory down here. Look what's going on up in Colorado. Can you believe it? June 9th, and they have a big snow. Look at that. Snow in Pueblo, Colorado. Incredible. On June 9th. <laughs> <laughs> and we have the heat down here. But look at this. Look at this. Everybody in green there, that's muggy. Everybody behind there, look at those dew points. That's dry air. That's a front. And that front's going to be here tomorrow morning. It's going to feel nice. Like levels, we check them every Tuesday here on TV3. Down a little bit this week. Combined system still a little bit over half full. Unfortunately, not a lot of rain in the forecast. Live picture from the Lexcam, 89 right now. The high has been 91. Winds out of the south, southeast at 10 miles per hour. Earlier in the show, we showed you what it felt like today here. The current, it still feels like 118 in Beeville. 106 in Corpus Christi, it still feels like 113 in Alice. Again, we will get relief in the overnight hours because a wind shift overnight. Little winds out of the north at 5 o'clock in the morning as that weak front comes on through. Cool front, it's more of a dry air front. And yes, there will be some rain overnight. Not a lot, a little bit. We'll take it. But during the day tomorrow, mostly sunny will be the forecast tomorrow afternoon. But temperatures will be 3 to 7 degrees cooler than they were today. And how much rainfall are we looking at? As you can see, not a lot. And the rain chances after tomorrow morning, little if any. All right, in the tropics, Cristobal, almost off the map there, right under the word tropical. Another system out there in the middle of the Atlantic, slight chance of development. KIIITV.com slash weather, click on Hurricane Central for 24-7 tropical updates. Here's the time cast for tomorrow, sunny and not as hot. After morning clouds, a little bit of rain, a high temperature of 92. Highs tomorrow ranging from 88 at the beach. And how hot will it get? 96 in George West. So 88 to 96, the temperature range. Water temperature offshore is 84. Caution for the bays, caution for the Gulf. Bays will all be choppy in the Gulf seas, 2 to 5 feet. Look at the winds out of the northeast at 10 to 20 miles an hour. Sun up at 634 in the morning. We'll have a high tide just past 10 a.m. at the beach. Sunny to partly cloudy in 88. The waves running four feet. We keep the rip current risk at high. And uh, I, I'm not anticipating any more big beach flooding, but the beaches are a mess, I can tell you that. Here's a look at the seven-day forecast. Oh, this weather's going to be nice these next several days. Look at temperatures in the upper 60s in the mornings, but hotter and more humid weather returns next week. So as hot as it's been today, Leslie, a little bit of dry air coming this way. It's going to feel nice for a couple of days. Updated 6, back to you.